This is our hip hinge exercise. Very, very, very important exercise to master this movement properly because it's gonna protect your back and it's gonna enable you to pick things up off the ground efficiently. But more importantly, it's gonna help you with your setup posture and your golf swing. So make, what you wanna do is grab a golf club or a broomstick. You're gonna need some type, of, um, some type of pole. First thing we're gonna do when we set up, okay? We talked about our standing posture. So when we talked about our standing posture, our toes were underneath our hips, okay? We squeezed our glutes, shoulder blades are back and down. Now I want you to watch me from the side here. Most people have a posture where they're, you can see my belt line is kind of tilted down, okay? When we squeeze our glutes and tighten up our stomach, what happens is, you can see here, as I squeeze my glutes, my belt line starts to level, okay? You see that? So, it's arched, my back is arched, my belt line is down. When I tighten my glutes, everything pops up. That's the number one most important thing because that's gonna protect your back. When that back is arched this way, it puts a lot of pressure in that low back. So by simply squeezing your glutes and tightening your core, all of a sudden, that levels out. So we have to start in that posture to begin our hip hinge. The next thing I want you to do is just hold on to your golf club, and I want you just to stand here and just pick one leg up at a time. Pick it up, and what you're gonna feel is, I want you to put your hand actually in this crease here. What that's gonna do is that's gonna tell you where your hip joint is, okay? So if you follow that line around from that crease, you'll see that your hip joint is way down here. It's not up here. So when we go to hinge our hips, this is the axis that we're gonna bend over, down here, not up here. So when we, when we look at that hip joint, that's what we're gonna to try to push back that way. So when we start our hip hinge, the first thing we wanna do is tighten up that stomach and glutes. That's gonna level our back. The next thing we're gonna do is, I just want you to feel where that crease is and just push back into that crease. In fact, you can take your club and put that right in that crease of where, where that hip joint is. And from there, I want you to push back. And as you can see, my hips are going backward. They're not, I'm not grounding. I'm pushing my hips back, okay? And then from here, I'm still keeping my back flat, and then I'm just gonna push that golf club forward. So again, push that back, push that forward. That's part one, I'm gonna show you part two next.